hi guys welcome to my channel and in this video we will be uh, doing an integration between telegram and uipath so basically we will be extracting the chats from the telegram uh, use in uipath and then we'll be exporting it out as an excel file so yeah so further we can use that data so for the telegram uh, i'll be using this web browser edge uh, browser so basically for the telegram we'll be using website version of the telegram so basically if i open this edge browser so here we can see in the web.telegram we have the telegram website and here we can see our chats and all the different groups which are there <coughs> so in this uh, video we will be using this republic chat so basically this is a news channel and if i just click it so we can see there are various articles and news on this channels which are posted <coughs> So we will use the UI path capability to navigate to this uh, portal and then search out the Republic chat and then it will jump to the so it will jump to this date so basically it will click here and it will navigate to the first day of the month so we will be able to see the articles from the first day of this particular month and then it will extract all these articles news articles which are below till the end of the page and then it will save it in an excel format uh, in this particular location so <clears throat> we'll quickly start with the UiPath setup. So here is our UiPath project, which is already set up. And these are the uh, files, project files, which we have created already. So basically I'll navigate through these files, which we have created for this process. So <clears throat> firstly, we, we have this uh, open telegram XAML. So in this, we can see, uh, in the beginning we have the kill process so basically it will kill the ms edge if any window is already existing and open so it will click that it will kill the ms edge window then we are using this uh, application <coughs> scope so in this scope we will be launching this uh, url web.telegram.org so this is the web version of the telegram and then here we are opening and setting up all these uh, properties as required so once it opens up so the bot will check if this uh, sandwich icon has appeared so if it appears so that basically validates that the telegram website is active and it's it has opened successfully <clears throat> so in this if it loads up so it will provide the message uh, in the log that telegram portal is launched and if it fails, so it will give us the message that uh, some error has occurred and it will throw an exception. So this is the uh, XAML for the open telegram uh, application. Then we have the open chat telegram. So basically in this page, what we are doing that uh, we are again connecting to the already opened up telegram page. Then we are uh, type into, we are searching out the uh, Republic chat. So basically the bot will come in here and it will type Republic and this Republic page will come on the top and it will click this chat so that it will come on the right side of the web page. So basically this chat uh, will open up and we can see all the news articles here. So similarly the bot will be making that it will enter the text in the search box Republic and it will click the div uh, where the chat for the Republic will come up 
and then <coughs> uh, so it will verify at this end that if that republic uh, this page is opened up fully so the next uh, page is uh, xaml is basically so in this one we will navigate to the first day of the month so we can get all the news articles from day one of that particular month so the bot will be going in here it will click this date label and then it will select the first day of the month it will click jump to date so we can see we have scrolled to the top where we can see the article from the first day of the month and then the bot will extract all these articles till the end of the page and so in these uh, clicks the bot will be doing that uh, activity and then we have the extract data table so in this one basically the bot is extracting all the articles so <clears throat> and it will be saving it in the data table then we are writing that uh, data table uh, all the news articles in a excel file and we can see the excel file will be saved up in this uh, location so now i'll quickly start with the uh, bot so i'll just go to the main page here we can see we have aligned all the pages so the last page is also the closed telegram so basically it will click that opened up it will close the uh, telegram page which is open and then it will click uh, kill the msh um, process if it's running so we can see here uh, i have aligned all these uh, pages in the main page so first it will open up the telegram second it will open the chat which is that required uh, chat from which where we have to extract the text then it will extract all the news articles and finally it will close the telegram window so i'll just quickly run it and we have clicked run so at this point the bot is compiling all the code and it will first close this already existing edge window so now we can see the bot has started so now it will launch the edge and it will open up the telegram web portal in that So as we can see, it has launched the Edge browser and it's opening the Telegram website. So currently, as we can see, it's loading. Okay, so it seems like my session is out. So <clears throat> so I'll quickly log in with the <clears throat> QR code which we can see here. So I'll scan it with my Telegram application and we will be logged in. okay so once we have logged in as we can see the bot is searching out the republic chat and it has found the republic chat in the top so now it will be clicking the republic chat okay and as we can see it has opened the republic chat in the right hand side now it will jump to the first day of the month okay so the calendar is opened up and it will click the first day of the month and 
it has jumped to the use articles from the month's beginning <clears throat> now it will extract all these news articles and in the background it will be saving it up in an excel file and finally it will close the uh, edge browser window so as we can see the bot has closed the edge browser window and now it's saving the news article in an excel file so we can check out the output results so the bot has completed all the activities without any error and the news articles found are 527 it took 3 minutes 17 seconds so if I navigate to the folder so this is the uh, news article saved in an excel file I'll just open it okay so as I can see here these are the news articles uh, so here's the heading and these are all the news articles it was able to capture from the page so yeah so yeah so this was our demonstration or a small use case in which we have uh, used the telegram uh, application or portal and using the UI path we have captured the data from the chats and we have exported it out in an excel file so yeah so from here on we can use it as we require and uh, yeah so this is one of the way of uh, integrating telegram with the path. so thank you guys and let me know if you want more detailed videos in which you want to see all the steps development steps uh, as as like uh, i developed these ones so how exactly these all steps are developed activities are developed so if you like if you want a more detailed video so please uh, comment and i'll be definitely sharing the more detailed videos for you guys okay thanks everyone thanks bye